Today, the drill will focus on recovery and getting people back into their homes. Advancements in technology could help to save your life when it comes to fighting fires. GMC's Jennifer Black joins us now live with details on what a local fire company is using to get to the scene of a fire faster than ever. Right, Jen? That's right, Haley. In April of 2007, the Seminole Trail Volunteer Fire Department implemented a touchscreen mapping system. It helps crews get to a scene faster and more prepared. I can actually see where my unit is. I can see where the call location is. The new touchscreen monitors replace a map book system firefighters describe as cumbersome. You would have two or three different map books for your first due area. Uh, if you went to another uh, area, you'd have to grab a different map book. So if we were going to the mall or a commercial uh, location, we would have the commercial location in this book. For a residential call, we would look in this book. This would have addresses and some hydrants. Now at the touch of a screen, pre-plans, contact information, hydrant availability, and cross-street locations are made readily available. It gives us more real accurate data as far as where exact addresses are. Like I said, it uses local county data versus um, consumer data. It can actually show you long driveways, so if a house, is, especially in a rural area, sits farther down a driveway, you know which driveway to take and you can see how far down it is. Firefighters admit while it did take some time to learn the new system, they see a world of difference. Uh, it gets through there quicker. It, it uh, gives us information that we didn't have before. We'd have to wait till we got on scene to find out what we were going into and now we have that information beforehand. It's so much easier than the old three ring binders, especially when it comes to updating them. From hand drawing maps to using a more detailed and up to date technology, firefighters can spend more time focusing on fighting fires and saving lives and property of people in our community. Get in the department and work on the basic skills that uh, will help them progress in the department. Now the software costs Seminole Trail about $10,000 to outfit 10 units. Crew members say the hardware also cost about twelve dollars to $1,300 per vehicle, a costly but important investment in safety. Live in the newsroom, Jennifer Black in Morning Charlottesville. A lot better than those big three-ring binders. Okay, Jen, thank you. The Stony Point Fire Department has also jumped on board with the new mapping system. And currently, Almoral County Fire Department, well, they're testing it on their units as well. Kind of a neat plan, huh? Yeah, it really is. Hopefully this will expand. Can you imagine having to go through that old binder? Oh, man. Not in the day of computers, huh? No, I don't think so. <laughs> well, some energy rates are about to go up here in Central Virginia.